Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley and well, if you've seen my other videos, then you are 100% able to recite what I'm about to say. Cause like I said in the last Salem vlog, I say the same thing in the beginning of my videos. Anyways, today we are going back to Salem I am so beyond excited to go back to Salem. If you've seen my videos and if you've seen my content before, then you know that Salem is one of my absolute favorite places to go to. I wish I lived there. I unfortunately don't live there, but I live close enough that I can drive there. Thank God. There's so many new things in Salem. So the first huge thing that I am so excited for is Black Craft Coffee. I am so excited for that. Coffee is just like the best thing in the whole world. And when I saw in the summer that Black Craft was going to be opening up a coffee shop like what is better than a black craft coffee shop like their vibe of the store is so cool so a coffee shop in that store is just beyond amazing i'm so excited to go to it in honor of it i am wearing my black craft shirt it says cute and spooky yes so ready for salem the second thing that i am very excited for is that there is actually a place i forgot what it was called but there's a place in salem that has permanent bracelets and i've been looking into permanent bracelets for a while but there's like nowhere around me that would do that and when i saw that there's a place in salem that has permanent bracelets so it's, I'm like count me in I am so excited for that I will just show you around the witch city which I am so excited for I have so many plans to show you we're going to a beautiful Airbnb which I will show you guys as well okay let's go into the Salem video hey everybody so it's officially our first time I mean first time here. first day here in Salem so I just made some breakfast and I made some toast eggs and bacon and coffee of course and it's called like maple vanilla coffee from Coven Beauty's Coven Coffee. Uh, it's not Coven Beauty's brand, but it's called Coven Coffee, I think. Yesterday, I just filmed a couple of like montage type of shots. We were driving around and Salem is so beautiful because it's still decorated for Christmas time, which is so nice. And we went to Flying Saucer Pizza and I got like Auburn or Audrey too. And in front of Flying Saucer, there's this huge tree, which I didn't, like I forgot about for some reason. Like it just kind of slipped out of my mind and it is so beautiful. And I was so excited to see that. And then we drove around and we looked at lights. And then today we're going to be going to Black Craft Coffee. As you can tell from my pajamas, I am wearing Black Craft pajamas. Of course I had to wear these in Salem. So yeah, let's go into our Salem day. So as you can tell, we didn't do like way too much today. We really just relaxed more than anything. We did go to Black Craft, but they said the cafe was closed at five and I was not happy about that. I ended up just going in front of the witch museum and taking some pictures. And then we went to Howling Wolf Taqueria and I got a, I think, what did I get? The Howling Wolf Burrito, I think it's called. Anyways, um, I think we're gonna make cookies, but if I don't see you guys until the morning, then good night. Hey guys, good morning. Let's make some coffee. so I am now all ready and before this I actually filmed to get ready with me which is fun so now we're going to finally go to black craft cafe and I am so beyond excited and I'll put some pictures on the screen of my outfit I am wearing like a lace red skirt and like this like lace top very vampire-esque no, Let's go walk around Salem in 20 degree weather. I'm so excited to be freezing, but I'm bringing a change of clothes. There's no way you're going to catch me just walking around like this all day because no, I'm not like a, a snow bear. Or what are they called? A polar bear. Not a polar bear. Okay. Let's go walk around Salem. We're walking around Salem. Woo! Walking around a nice skirt. We're on our way to Black Craft Coffee. I am ready. I look like a Salem local at the moment. You guys want to see me walking? Walk and talk. Okay, so if I lived here... What are you going to do right now? Black Craft Coffee. What are we doing after? We're taking a picture in front of the cathedral. The first cathedral. Oh God, Ashley, so Salem. Amazing. Oh my god, Ash, you're so amazing. Thank you very much. One of our favorite restaurants here is Dire Wolf, by the way. Dire Fun Wolf fact. Or the Boston Burger Company. Yeah, Boston Burger Company has a really good Big na Big Mac. <laughs> big Mac Burger. <laughs>
So behind me is the first church of Salem, and it looks very nice. I took some pictures. There's a whole thing, so let's go. So in my hand is the Spellbound Pumpkin Latte, and I took a video of like the ingredients and stuff so you guys can see. I've already seen the Hocus Pocus Mansion, which is also behind there, and then right here is the Witch House very notorious place. I am so in love with Black Crafts Cafe. It is so adorable. Like, just look at the cup. I took so many pictures. I'm so happy. Hey guys, we're now back at the Airbnb and I just wanted to show you guys what we got. Also, um, this lamp right here. Pretend like it's not there. I'm sharing a room with my sister and the lamp was just bright. So we moved it down there so it's not as bright. Okay, now that we've got that settled. So we went to Dire Wolf for dinner and from there I got salmon. And then for appetizers, we got dumplings, we got sushi. And the sushi we got was the Kobe roll, which is really good by the way. We got fried pickles and also chicken. And then we went to Goodnight Fatties and they had a fluffernutter cookie, which is like a peanut butter cookie with marshmallow and graham cracker on top. They had a cannoli cookie. And then my personal most excited one, which was a Oreo mocha cookie. The reason I'm so excited for it is because it's a vegan cookie. I remember seeing this cookie a long time ago and I literally came here and the week after I left, they had that cookie and I'm like, are you kidding me? I literally, cause I can't have dairy. So I was like, okay, that's rude. <laughs> so they brought it back this week and I'm so happy about that. So I just wanted to show you guys now what I got from Black Craft Cafe as well as the normal Black Craft place. So from Black Craft Cafe, I got this adorable mug that says black craft coffee and then it also says on the bottom salem ma and it has their cute little black craft coffee logo then of course i got a shirt and these shirts i have seen all over online and it's so cute because it looks like it has spilt coffee over it like and then it has the black craft coffee logo of course it says black craft coffee and then also salem ma on the bottom then my mom got a candle from black craft coffee and it says dark roast and then on top it has the black craft coffee logo and then some glitter and it smells like coffee too which is really nice then of course i got a candle and it is a scream candle and it has a little ghost face on top it's like the cutest scream candle i've ever seen it has a little glitter knife and it has glitter and it just looks like blood it's just the cutest candle i've ever seen then lastly me and my mom both got socks i got these really adorable socks that say you make me feel alive and r.i.p and if you know me then you know i love coffee so these are just perfect and they have cute little skeletons on it then my mom got these really cute socks that say stay toxic and they have these cute little poison apples on it with heart eyes so that is everything that we got we have a late night coffee run at jaho which is like right down the street it's cool what's nice is that this place is actually open until 11 so if you wanted to come here like late at night you really could which is fun i like it here little skeleton peeking in hey guys good morning we are now going to go to black craft coffee once again that was probably like one of the best coffees i've ever had it was delicious and i am going back to get it again i'm not sure if i want to try something different but we'll see and then i also want to go to wicked good books i also want to go to nocturne and then there's a jewelry place as permanent bracelets and i'm pretty sure it's called jenny stewart so yeah let's go also it's supposed to snow tonight i'm so excited I really do love this Airbnb. It's just, it's just so amazing. Salem, 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 Salem. <sighs> so pretty here. now just walking around uh, Salem. It's gonna snow later tonight so it feels like it but I got a spellbound pumpkin latte from Black Craft with oat milk. Boston Bird Company and I got I got the hot mess and I got this adorable bracelet. It's a little boo. I love it so much. It's a permanent bracelet. You wanna show yours? You already oh saw goodness. Jessica's. I got this one. around and it's currently snowing in Salem. Here's the beautiful tree. 
We are in Blackcraft Coffee for the second time. It's that good. And it literally tastes like you took a piece out of pumpkin pie, the one that I got, the Spellbound Latte, and then she got the Magic Mocha. Salted caramel and hazelnut. Good morning. It is snowing here in Salem. It looks like a snow globe. So pretty. One thing that's really cute is that our Airbnb actually has a porch. So I'm going to show you guys outside. It's all wet, but from Van Fangs. I got this really awesome skull bag. This is what the bag comes in when you get anything from Van Fangs. It's so pretty. And I remember I used to see this on Killstar all the time. I never saw it in person, so like I wasn't sure how big it was, but I absolutely love it so much. It's so cool. I am now going to do something that is not a shocker one bit. I'm going to make some coffee. I love coffee. And I'm going to use my new Blackcraft mug today. It's not the biggest mug in the world, but it is really cute. So let's make some coffee. I'm so happy it's snowing so much in Salem right now. It's sticking. It looks like a snow globe. At this point, I have like 100 videos and pictures because I'm obsessed with the snow. And that's one thing I've always wanted to see in Salem was the snow. My dreams have come true. A snow day in Salem. <laughs> Good morning. We are sadly leaving our beautiful Airbnb today. It is sad, but at least we got to enjoy a nice Salem snowstorm. And we're gonna get Blackcraft coffee at least. I'm wearing my Blackcraft coffee shirt already and the socks. They're so cute. I'm not like one to wear colorful socks, but I will wear socks at schools. I'm gonna miss this Airbnb so much. It was so cozy. Also, I found out that Wicked Good Books is actually in another store now. It's in like Silly Bunny or something. It's kind of by Witch City Wicks. Definitely Blackcraft Coffee before I go, because I'm gonna miss that so much. Also, I want to see the witch house in the snow. I would have went yesterday, but we had to park the car like two blocks because in Salem, like certain streets get blocked off, so. I just got a Spellbound Latte from Blackcraft, and it's amazing. They actually make their own milk, which I saw. And now I'm going into Wicked Good Books, which is right here. It's in this store now. So let's see if they have any books to read. Right now, I am in front of the one and only Ropes Mansion. And this house was in Hocus Pocus, obviously. If you've seen the movie, then you know. And it looks so pretty, everything in the snow. Like, just look at this street. If I ever will, when I live in Salem, really, I want to live on this street because it just, it just is so pretty and so peaceful with these sidewalks, beautiful houses. And then, of course, Ropes Mansion. Then all the way over there is a witch house and then a cathedral, which is also very pretty. Love Salem in the snow with my coffee. In my new book, the book that I got from the bookstore is actually called Ghost Story. It was hard for me to choose because they had a lot of really good books. If I didn't read Frankenstein already, I would have definitely gone. It. It's a good book. so much for watching the Salem vlog. I hope you guys liked it. Be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. I can't do like that hand thing I do because I'm holding the microphone. Also be sure to comment down below other videos you guys would like to see on my channel and also if you would like to see more Salem videos and if you'd like to see more Salem videos what would you like to see me do in Salem? Anyways I hope you guys have a super amazing day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!